What's up, y'all? I appreciate y'all tuning back into the channel. So today I'm going to be showing y'all how to record vocals in FL Studio 20.9. Also, I'm going to be showing y'all how to do quick punches as well. So if you find this video helpful at all, please hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you'll be updated when I put out videos like this. I found a lot of tutorials on YouTube on how to record an FL and how to do punch-ins. And to be honest, they was kind of complicating and it could be frustrating and even a little intimidating to uh, new beginners. So here on Ryan P Media, you know, I'm gonna show y'all the simple, easy, quick way to do these things, all right? So again, if you found this video helpful, hit that subscribe button, let's go. All right, so assuming that you already got your audio interface installed and you already did gang staging, I'm gonna just show you guys how to record vocals and do some punch-ins. If you don't know how to install your audio interface with FL, or you don't know how to do proper gang staging, leave a, leave a comment down below and I'll, I'll make a video on that. So make sure y'all subscribe so y'all can you know, be notified when I make these videos, all right? So, first things first, I pop up, no, I'm just saying. All right, so I got the beat right here. And again, I'm just showing y'all the simple way. I'm not gonna go into um, uh, getting a, a BPM and all of this extra stuff. I'm just showing y'all how to record some vocals. So anyway, so I got the beat right here. So what you wanna do is always assign your beat to a channel. So you double left click and I put it in channel one already. So it's gonna be right here. Matter of fact, I'm gonna just name it so I don't confuse y'all. So we're just gonna put beat. All right, so right here, track two, I'm going to right click. I'm just gonna name this record so y'all know. All right, so this is where we're going to uh, record our vocals. So uh, track two is highlighted. You wanna come over here. Yours is gonna look a lot different. I actually got a bunch of stuff. I need to clean all of this up, but this is my microphone right here. So as you can see, the microphone is on. Now, what we're gonna do, track three. And, and trust me, all of this is gonna make a lot of sense and it's gonna be so much easier, especially when you're doing punch-ins. Um, so this is track three. We're going to name this to vocals. Now on track three, as you see, I already got my presets right here, which I will be having presets for sale real soon. So y'all stay tuned for that. But, um, so this is where your, your vocals is going to go into track two raw, but they're going to come out in track three and they already going to have the uh, your presets on it or whatever. This is gonna help for when you're doing quick punching because when you're doing quick punching, you just wanna hit the record, say something, hit the record, say something. You don't wanna have to edit every stem or every track that you do. So, um, and I'm gonna show you guys, it's gonna make a lot more sense in just a minute. So anyway, so you wanna click track, track two where your microphone is. After you selected your microphone, hit this button right here this yellow and go down to external and mixer input. Okay. After you do that, come down here to the bottom of track three. You want to right click, go down to side chain to this track only. All right. So now you are ready to go. I'm just turn that up a little bit. I'll turn that up. All right. So, now we're ready to go. So now all I have to do, hit the record button or hit the letter R on your keyboard. And I'm gonna show you guys. So I'm just gonna say some stupid stuff, so don't mind me. Y'all probably can't, y'all, matter of fact, I know for a fact, y'all won't even hear the music until after I get done doing it, so. Yeah. Came in the game, I get it. Y'all know my name, I'm with it. So then I stop and then I just hit the space bar again to record. You know I'm with gang, I'm with it. See how I'm just adding to it, just simply quick. I'm stacking up all my, hold on, I messed up on the part. I'm stacking up all my figures. And you could just keep going every time. 
One, two, three, four, five, I'ma get it. Came out the kitchen whipping. So as you can see, I'm just steady adding to it, adding to it. And the cool thing is all of these audio files that you see me recording, they already have your presets on it. So the only thing that you will have to do occasionally is just if one sounds louder than the other, you know, you might have to double double uh, left click and adjust the volume. But for the most part, they already got the effects on it. So here, let me show you guys what I'm what I'm talking about. So now I'm gonna play it. Let's see. Came in the game, I get it. Y'all know my name, I'm with it. You know I'm with gang, I'm with it. I'm stacking up all my figures. One, two, three, four, five, I'ma get it. Came out the kitchen whipping. Boom, just simple, just like that. Let me move this out the way. Move, bruh. Straight up. Anyway, so yeah, so again, all of these already have the presets on them. And you could just keep going and keep going and keep going and then you could go back and tweak and edit them and and all of that but that's the simplest way a lot of people try to have you record like they'll tell you record and then they'll go down to track mode assigned to a track and that's so complicated to me um, it's, it's you're going to get the same results this is just a lot quicker um if this didn't make sense and you're still having trouble understanding leave me a message comment let me know. I will definitely get you right. We can video chat and I will walk you through how to do it because I rock with y'all. If y'all rocking with me, I rock with y'all. You know what I'm saying? So that's it. That's the simplest way and to do punch-ins because a lot of people, I've seen people do punch-ins to where they'll, they'll be recording on a track and then after they done, then they have to go to the next track and, and then record and go to the next track and record with this. You just simply hitting the space bar saying what you're gonna say boom your 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 presets is on there and everything so if y'all got any questions comment down below if you found this video helpful make sure y'all hit that subscribe button i appreciate y'all tuning in and to the next episode we are out make sure y'all jump in the description box and go stream my music all right peace